guess Daniel, welcome to the team. I mean, get in there and get under the fire right there. Talk about your experience today. Um, it was actually a really good experience. Um, it was my first time I ever playing in the stadium. Uh, it, was, it, was, it was a lot of fun. Um, yeah, I had a good first time playing out there. So. Did you know what you were doing? I actually finally knew what I was doing, yes. <laughs> Coach talked about how quickly you've been able to pick up things here. I mean, what, what's that process been like for you as you're trying to get adjusted? This is it's, it's definitely been a long, stressful process so far. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a lot, especially coming from a spread to a triple option offense. I had to learn all new steps, footwork, um, different new um, reads and all that. So it's it's been a long, stressful process. You're able to show off your mobility out there. Is that the part of the game you really like? Yeah, I, I love running the ball. How much easier has it been for you to focus on the ball? Uh, a lot easier. You can you can uh, actually focus on the fundamentals of one position instead of having to worry about both. And I uh, I think that that I you could tell that I've that I've improved on the things that I've been trying to work on during the spring with just working on that one position. Jim, talk about. Um your experience today started well, and then it kind of got a little shaky toward the middle and the latter third. Um, so uh, I definitely have to give credit to the defense. Um, as you can tell, last fall, um, defense kept the offense in some of the games, um, and uh, I definitely have to give credit to them. Uh, coming out, uh, you know, everybody's up high, but um, you know, throughout the spring, uh, we're talking with the coaches and them telling us that our main thing is, you know, we want to stay consistent. Um, so that's something that we got to keep working on, keep honing it on, and me, myself, uh, most especially, I have to keep working on that. And as the process keeps going on, it's going gonna, it's gonna to come. Overall, did you feel like the offense on both sides, both of you guys felt like the offense, Chandler first, he felt like the offense was in tune. It looked like the, they moved the ball pretty, pretty consistently. Yes, sir, I believe so, because if you uh, go back and look at the film when we first came in, it's... Uh, it's uh, <laughs> It's very fun to watch, let's put it that way. But, um, you know, you look at us now, we're able to open up the playbook. Um, you're able to trust other guys out there. Um, and that just expands your playbook even more. You're able to have even more fun. And that gives the defense even more looks that they have to, you know, look at each week coming in. They only have three days to prepare for us, and we have tons of plays to go against that. So um, as we continue to grow and mature, you know, as a team, as players, it's going to come and it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun to watch. Coach talked a lot about, I guess, with you guys about avoiding that sophomore slump. What do you notice, I guess, in the team right now, the difference as you have a, a, year, a season under your belt and, and heading out of, and wrapping up this spring? Um, the difference now um, is that there's not any more first. You know, now it's just going out there and knowing your assignment, knowing what you got to do, and just play ball. Um, and that's something um, as a team that we have to stay consistent at. We got to keep honing on that. The coaches are going to be on top of us about that. Um, we just got to go out there, play ball, have fun, most importantly, and just know your assignment, and then the rest will take care of it itself, you know. And uh, the biggest thing is uh, turnovers. Um, and if we can, uh, you know, eliminate those, then we're going to have a pretty fun season. Coach was saying that you were having a really good spring. Um, how much more comfortable are you in the offense than what you did? Um, so this spring what they did was is, uh, allow Trey to uh, nurse that shoulder. Um, that he suffered in the uh, season last year, and it allowed me to come in um, not with as many reps coming off ACL uh, injuries. So um, that, in a long, just allowed me to become more comfortable, um, allowed me to settle in, and then you know stop thinking about so much, and then at that point just react, play, and have fun. Nick, uh, Coach Newberry talked about uh, trying to improve the tackling this spring and limiting the big plays on defense. It seemed like y'all did a fairly good job against the run, limiting the big plays, had some issues against the pass. But how about the tackling? How, how do you think you did on that today? I think we've improved uh, tremendously this spring, um, going from the first couple of weeks as, as opposed to this last week. Mm -hmm. um, every practice we work uh, those tackling circuits, we work the, really work the fundamentals of tackling and how we're taking the head out of our tackling and work different types of tackling. Um, I think that's helped us being able to drill those every single day, and it's starting to translate onto the field. So that's a big part. Was it good tackling today? I believe so.
And the inside running, that's you know, been another focus of the offense. How do you think the, uh, you and Micah did in the offensive line and doing the trim tackles today? Oh, I, I definitely want to credit offensive line. They've done an awesome job this spring of uh, opening holes and doing, doing what they got to do. But I, I think that Micah and myself have both um, improved a lot running the ball inside. Uh, and I think uh, most everybody would agree because we're actually getting some stuff done on the inside run, which we didn't much during the season. Uh, but, but yeah, I think that we've definitely grown up a lot and we're doing much better with it. Did either one of you have any negative runs today? Do you know I don't think so. I don't, I don't think you did. I know there were some handoff issues and stuff like that, but it was negative. Yeah, I think it was positive for the most part about the whole time. Jake, you had a couple opportunities to uh, to catch the football and make some plays. How comfortable are you in uh, in the role of the pass catcher? Because I'm assuming that you've thrown it a lot more than you've caught. Way more. <laughs> 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 no, I, I'm pretty comfortable with it. Um, I mean, I haven't done it a whole lot, but I enjoy it. So I feel like I uh, feel like I do a fairly good job with it. So uh, yeah, I think I think it's going pretty well throughout the spring too. So. Chicken and ribs? Oh, no, yeah. Chicken and ribs. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Nick, what do you think of this score? <laughs> it's fair. Uh, I'll give it to the offense. They uh, they did well, uh, especially gold. But um, I, I'm a little disappointed that we're going to be eating hot dogs and baked beans on, on Monday. Um, but I do have to give it to the offense. They played really well today. You know, I bet you if you pay one of these guys, they'll get you a rib somewhere. <laughs> Anything else? That's all, thank you. Thank you. Oh, okay. Okay.